How many times have I done this? And I still hate it. I swear Abbott's full enough already. <laughs> At least when you escort an inmate to death row, you know he's scheduled to get what he deserves. Ernesto, you can really be a jackass, you know that? But you hear what this one did? I don't want to know, and you know what he I- He beat his ex-wife to a bloody pulp. Killed her with his fists. Look, I said I didn't- Then he drowned one son in the tub, and threw the other out a window. Don't ask me to cry for him. Whew. Inmate, is this true? Oh, he won't say. Claims he blacked the whole thing out. <laughs> a likely story. The needle's too good for him. Filthy inmate, they should all die. Willie's bed isn't even cold yet, and already they brought in a new guy. I heard he killed his old lady and kids. Sick motherfucker. Be quiet, you jerry curled fool. Don't you know who that is? Why should I? That's Tork, the man himself. Word is he sheared half the Aryan Brotherhood over at Easton. So fucking what? I can understand a guy killing his old lady, but he popped his kids too. Motherfucker deserves to be strapped down and dosed. You believe what the CEOs tell you, Slick? You don't know shit about the man. I'm telling you, what I heard, he's all right. That cocksucker's not gonna be all right for long if he's in the row with the rest of us short timers. Shut your cracker ass, Goose. Man's do respect. You show him respect. I decide who I respect, shit boy. Don't you go tell me. Quiet down in there. Some of you want to go back on the loaf? I didn't think so. Hey, you. Yeah, you. Neighbor. Nice to meet you. My name's Floyd. How long you got to get turned on the table, huh? You all out of appeals? Your lawyer fuck you? I read about your trial. They got no witnesses, all circumstantial evidence. No one knows what really happened but you. But you can't remember a thing, is that right? Best not to listen to him talk. Floyd's a degenerate parasite. They should have slapped the cuffs on him coming out of his mama's At least tongue. I know Jesus is with me, man. Whatever I've done, the Reverend says Jesus has forgiven me. Will you shut the fuck up, you baby-raping, sodomizing sack of shit! I was just asking the man a question, Goose. Whoa! What the fuck shit, is this shit? It's an fuck, what the hell's going on? The internet. CO, you gotta let us the out. Ropes. We're still humans, man. The whole we fucking got place is coming down. Sweet Jesus, what the hell was that? Slick. You okay, man? Is the prison collapsing? Are we sinking into the ocean? See you! See you! What the hell's going on? Slick! What in the fuck just happened? Slick! Slick! Goose, you still there? Yeah, I'm still here. And it wasn't me. If that's what you're thinking, I didn't touch that. What was that? Goose? Oh, for fuck's sake, what's going on? That was close. I thought we were done for. We gotta get out of this shit can before it collapses. Shit. There's something in here. It's in here! Help me! Back in your cell. Everything's under control. Contained in these pages are my observations of the bizarre creatures that have appeared on Carnate Island since the cataclysm struck. The creatures emerge in a variety of ways, but many of them appear to come from within the island itself, as if the very earth of Carnate were poisonous and vile. Though I scarcely have time to keep a journal like this while trying to keep myself alive, my inquisitive nature forces me to write down what I see, in the hope that I might better understand it. But how can this unspeakable horror possibly be understood? 
It is as if Carnet's horrific sins, both past and present, are being brought to life in a pageant of death. When Ernesto took his job at Abbott, I was far from excited. When he told me we would need to move to Carnate Island as well, I was not happy at all. But I tried to find a good side to the situation. I have always been interested in the history of unique places. What kind of history would we find on Carnate? This scrapbook project was started primarily to fill my time here, but also so I could record what I had discovered. In my exploration of the island, I uncovered many of Carnate's secrets. Though I record them here, I do not think I will tell the world about what I have found. Carnate is a place whose secrets are best kept to itself. Abbott State Penitentiary. Originally built as part of Fort Mallison to house German POWs during World War II, it was taken over by Maryland following the war and converted into Abbott State Penitentiary. Mostly built out of local quarry rock, the prison is now home to nearly 1,000 inmates and has the worst safety record and highest homicide rate of any prison in the Maryland Department of Corrections system. The state also carries out the majority of its death sentences here. Follow me! Huh? 
get out of there. That island's more than just a prison. It's so much worse. It brings out the worst in everyone. Get out of there, T. Run! Run as fast as you can! God, I made it into the light. I think I'm safe in the light. You've got to get me out of here! No! I can't see what's going on. I hear sounds, but when I shine the spot down there, it's like everything scampers out of the way. I can't see well enough. Shit, get away from me! Man, I killed it. But that thing's impossible. Like some kind of spider with swords. Goddamn inmates behind this, I know they are. Is anyone listening to me? I think maybe I'd just better stay up here where I'm sitting. <laughs> Slayer, I first witnessed these creatures jumping out of the ground itself. Their heads were detached from their torsos, held aloft by hideous contraptions. Their limbs have been replaced by blades of the sharpest steel. To my eyes, they appear to be a manifestation of decapitation. Yet it seems improbable anyone ever had their head chopped off an abbot. 
I suppose uncarnate anything is possible. I have dubbed these monstrosities slayers. Die, goddamn you, die! I'm just about enough of you, Hold it right there, or I will cut you down! You hear me, inmate? Do you hear me? Give him a chance. Kill him. Ah, to hell with protocol. Him. Everything's gone to shit. Right now, I prefer a murdering scum fuck from the road or one of those monstrosities. We got a better chance to survive if we stick together. But you will do exactly what I say, or I will punch a hole in your sorry ass. Got it? Calm down, Fuck team. you. Don't let your when I see these bastards spawn, prefer to stay in the dark. Go get a flashlight from the break room down the hall. And no funny stuff, or I will blow your head off. Comprende? A lot of the lights were destroyed in that earthquake. You'll need a flashlight to see a damn thing. All right, you got a light. We gotta head downstairs to get out of this shithole. And you better stay out of my way. If I need to shoot more of those fuckers, I will not hold my fire on your account. You read me? That's the last of them. You handled yourself all right, for an inmate. Carnate Island's got a strange history, and Abbott is one fucked up who's gal. And let me tell you, we better stay away from the fucking basement. If things are bad up here, down there, it's gonna be like the mouth of hell. I always saw the good in you. Help me! It God won't damn. stop! What the hell was that? It never I gotta check it out. Stay here! when I was done. Anyone hear me? This is Hawks again. I tried to get to the radio building, but there's so many of those, those things that they look like yorks with stilts on. They're all over the yard and I couldn't get through. Has anyone called for help yet? And they'll need to call in the military to clean this mess up. What's that there? Bloody hell!
No, that's okay. I, I told you I didn't want you here. It's, it's better this way, Ma. Now, come on, Ma. Don't cry. It's not doing anybody any good at all. You know I love you, right? And the Reverend said I won't feel a thing. The island. Carnate Island is approximately three miles wide and lies some ten miles off the coast of Maryland. In addition to man-made structures, Carnate is also home to a labyrinthine natural cave system unlike anything I have seen before. Through my studies, I learned of the island's dark and unsettling history. Though it may sound ridiculous to say it, Carnate seems to bring out the worst in those who make the mistake of coming here. Hear ye, hear ye. This is Radio Free Abbott. The inmates are running the show now, suckers. This here's MC25 to life, and I want you to know that I am calm like a bomb. Let me tell you, I done seen more dead CEOs today than I ever dreamed I would. And I want to say, they all had it coming. I don't know what the fuck is going on, but I like it.
CEOs at Abbott and their practical jokes, but Jesus, <laughs> our fucking hearty har, very funny. Joke's over now, guys. Come on, let me out. Murphy, was this your idea? Hawks? Which one of you fuckers thought of this? Uh, maybe a new Jack, but you think I was born yesterday? I'm not scared. I know this thing was decommissioned in the 80s. They will the door shut and everything. No way it can hurt me. How'd you guys get me in here anyway? Hello? Hello? Anyone hear me? These bastards should put these straps on tight. Is that part of the gang, huh? Guys? Hello? God damn it! Just get me out of here, you cocksucker! Leave you alone until you do it. <laughs> 